Oh, he's ready, Gargiulo. He is ready. Jerry Lynn is a former world heavyweight champion and former. himself. You won't show. You Jerry won't Lynn has not competed in a wrestling ring show. since August the 7th. This is his very first match back from knee surgery. He had his patella operated on, he injured his knee working in another organization, and they dropped him from his contract. Those sickos, those ingrates. And he has returned here tonight to test himself in the building he helped make famous and the building that helped made him famous. And Eric, what kind of question is that to me? Is the champ ready? When you are a world champion, something that you wouldn't know, you are always ready. You're ready for anything, at any time, any place. Justice Payne has proven in the past that he thrives off of being tested. He is at, a, he is at his best when he has tested. We have had wrestlers like Yoshihiro Tajiri, the Messiah, and countless, countless others walk in here and open challenge the champion, Justice Payne, and he has survived all challengers. He has beaten all of America, not just survived, but he has beaten all the challengers. Right, Paul? Who, did, who put Jerry Lynn tonight? Who do you think put Jerry Lynn tonight? Who do you think did that, Eric? I think the boss did it, Eric. I think Zanuck brought him here. That's what I think. I wouldn't put my money on that, Eric. I don't think John Zanuck's smart enough to book someone like Jerry Lynn, Eric. Jerry Lynn with a reverse Corey Guerrero special there. Justice Payne shoots him in, Jerry Lynn. This is gonna be an absolute classic here. Justice Payne shooting Jerry Lynn in. Jerry Lynn with the total roll, head scissors. Jerry Lynn, the Minneapolis native, has been wrestling in this business since 1988. This match has all the makings of a classic. Think you can identify Minneapolis on the map, Eric? I'm not gonna comment. I'm not gonna comment on your frivolous statements you're gonna make during a classic match. Like, who do you think you are, the owner of this company? <laughs> Eric, he's the boss. You better start showing him some respect, Eric. Both athletes in tremendous physical condition, but as the match goes on, how will Jerry Lynn's knee hold up? Has Jerry Lynn hit the wall? 14 years in the wrestling business, sure. You're gonna experience some injuries out there, but has he hit the wall? Has he become brittle? Has he become one of these wrestlers that's gonna start falling apart 14 years in the business, or was that injury just a fluke? We just got rid of the guy that was falling apart. I don't know, I think this guy can hack it. I think you were falling, falling apart the last time I saw you out there. Yeah, Eric, we just got rid of a guy that was falling apart, Eric. Wait a minute, what's Steve Rives doing out here? Steve Rives taking liberties with Jerry Lynn. Jerry Lynn gave Steve Rives a cradle pile driver earlier tonight. He's just paying him back, Eric. And Brian Logan is sending him to the locker room. He does not have a manager's license. To Justice Payne, reputation means nothing. Reputation means nothing at all. The reputation of Jerry Lynn means nothing to Justice Payne. Countless others have walked in here with bigger reputations than Jerry Lynn. And Justice Payne has faced all of those challenges. And beat them. But is Jerry Lynn the first guy to walk in here and finally shut up Justice Payne? He got right in his face earlier. Told him he couldn't stand him. Told him he was a bitch for his crying. Crying every week out here. A pain in the behind to us, the fans at CZW. He will talk his talk, Eric. Let's see if Jerry Lynn can back it up. I, I shot up Justice Payne in the cage of death. Yeah, you did. Now, what did you think of Justice Payne coming out here last month and congratulating you in the ring? I remember the last time you hit Nick Mondo with a crutch. Justice Payne was the first one to come out here and berate you. Uh, I, I don't, your memory's a lot better than me. I don't know what he's talking about, boss. I, this, this, this Eric, he has this, this memory. He just uh, he, he sees what he wants to see, this guy. Fabric, that's exactly what it is. Fabrication. But right now, Justice Payne is in total control of Jerry Lynn, Eric. Jerry Lynn's not a guy that's gonna make those little mistakes, but how will that ring rust fare for Jerry Lynn? Jerry Lynn with a sunset flip has won many championships over his career with that move. Not enough. Jerry Lynn, boot to the midsection. A new tenant has arrived in this building since the last time Jerry Lynn has been here. An overhead belly to belly throw. A new class has enrolled and Jerry Lynn wants to be a part of it. What does that say for the reputation of Combat Zone Wrestling where Jerry Lynn chooses his first match back to be here in Viking Hall? 
I hate to see what the reputation of this company is going to be three months from now with new ownership. Boss, where do you see what I'm going to do with this company, Eric? Where do you see? Yeah, Eric, you where do you see what he does with this company? The only reason Jerry Lynn and me, all these other guys, the only reason anybody knows about CZW is because I made CZW. That's it. It's two cages, three cages of death, pyramid of hell, you name it. Me. All me, Eric. Nobody takes away your accomplishments, but I still do not understand the change of attitude and direction. How can you walk in here, look at where we are right now, a sold-out Viking Hall, and you have come in here and take, you, you took the dreams of a man away. You took a company, a man's livelihood. He may have to go on unemployment. He may have to go on a welfare because of you. That welfare cheese tastes pretty good, Eric. Don't cry too hard for John Zander. And Justice Payne slaps on the STF on Jerry Lynn, Eric. Justice Payne is a man that thrives on being tested. And the confidence that he has, some call it cockiness, some call it confidence. Tonight it is put to the test by Jerry Lynn, the new effing show, but is Justice Payne truly the new effing show? Smart move there by the champ. He takes Jerry Lynn right down and applies pressure on the knee, Eric. Jerry Lynn is the kind of wrestler that walks into a company and automatically the roster, the company, CZW, the fans, the television show, everything, the stock goes up around here. And look at Justice Payne just going to work right on that injured knee, the knee that just came back from patella surgery. Staying right on that knee, and that's exactly what the champ has to do. Jerry, Jerry Lynn. Jerry Lynn in tremendous condition. Jerry Lynn, of course, made his reputation in wrestling matches against who some of you out there know as X-Pac, Sean Waltman, the Lightning Kid, and the old global wrestling organization. I wonder if we're gonna wind up like them and go bankrupt. You heard me. Hello, blown air by Jerry Lynn. I'm surprised, I think that makes you proud, Gorgulo. Absolutely, Jerry Lynn can fight fire with fire. Jerry Lynn can be just as dirty as Justice Payne. It's the experience factor. Jerry Lynn slips up on those ropes there. It's that ring rust. Tornado DDT on the World Heavyweight Champion. Justice Payne has made quite a few enemies as of late. Remember, it was last month when he beat the hell out of Nick Gage, knocking him unconscious. Nick Gage isn't even here tonight. Of course, we all saw what happened earlier. He is reunited with the backseat boys. They took out Nate Hatred. What kind of order is going on here at CZW, boss? Hmm. Well, I don't know, Eric. Show's not over yet. Still plenty could happen. Who knows? Yeah, who knows, Eric? Anything can happen here, okay? Justice. You say Justice Payne attacked Nick Gage in the last show? Yes. Hmm. I wonder if there's going to be retribution for that. And how, and how angry is Nate Hatred going to be when he comes back again? He's going to rip this place apart. He's a madman. He's definitely not a person you want to have on your bad side. Neither is Nick Gage. Neither is Lobo. Neither is the boss, Eric. Neither is the boss. It's kind of an interesting situation there, boss. You have Justice Payne, who seems to be packing your lunch these days, and you also have an association with the do Nick Cage and Nate Hatred. Interesting to see how things play out over the next couple of weeks, boss. The only reason he packs my lunch is because he cuts the crust off my bread. All right. I'm sure he does cut the crust off your bread. Does he, does he spread the mayonnaise across the cheeks as well? PB and J, Eric. PB and J. But don't worry, Eric, we saved the tossing of the salad for you. <laughs> Double clothesline there, both wrestlers off of their feet. And not only is this a test for Justice Payne, but this is a test for Jerry Lynn. Justice Payne represents the new generation of stars, the new generation that see guys like Jerry Lynn, they don't have it anymore. They should step aside. Does Jerry Lynn have it? Does he have what it takes? Can he hang in there with this new generation? I mean, Eric, Jerry Lynn came in here and called, called our champion a bitch in his own house. He sure did. Those are very, very strong words. Jerry Lynn. Here though. Jerry Lynn backs down against nobody. I bet he would back down from Lobo. Jerry Lynn is a former world heavyweight champion. Jerry Lynn has held belts in every single major promotion in the world you can think of, except one, Combat Zone Wrestling. Never held the belts that I've held, Eric. And not tonight either, if the champ can help it. A plancha over the top. Jerry Lynn on that unforgiving floor, the impact. Two. 
Both wrestlers in tremendous physical conditioning. This one can go 60 minutes. Whatever it takes. We got nothing but time, Eric. There will be a winner here tonight. Oh, there will be a winner, Garth. Are you Jordan. guaranteeing that? That's a guarantee. See, this boss puts guarantees, okay? I'm not like that other guy. Yeah. The other guy that helped build this company and bring us here. I feel nothing. This company was built on my blood, sweat, and tears. I carried this company. Everybody knows. It. I was on the cover of the Daily News, Eric. The Daily News? He was on the cover of the Daily News, Eric. The man Dog Pearson put you on the cover Bam! of the Daily News. Blockbuster there by Justice Payne on the Jerry Lynn. And there goes Jerry Lynn looking up at the lights. You know, we've all seen Jerry Lynn get extreme in the past, but can he get ultra violent? That is the question here tonight. Justice Payne has not only hung in there with Jerry Lynn, but he has had the advantage for the majority of this matchup. And remember this, Eric. The champ doesn't have to beat Jerry Lynn. Jerry Lynn has to beat the champ. And the champ better be watching all sides of this arena tonight because even though Nick Gage is not in this building, he could enter at any time. Who knows where Nate Hatred is? He's made a lot of enemies in his career. This World Heavyweight Champion of ours. Jerry Lynn with almost a decapitating leg drop. I can't see that happening. Would, they, would Nick Gage and Nate Hatcher do something like that? I've never seen you do that. Jerry Lynn now slow to get to his feet, climbing the ropes. Jerry Lynn, a chameleon like Justice Payne. He can brawl. Taking a lot climb. of time to get to that top rope, Eric. Jerry Lynn crouched down. Eric, pick me a winner right now. Pick me a winner this match. Yeah, Eric. I'd say at this point, it's got to be Justice Payne. He's had the distinct advantage throughout the majority of the matchup. And Jerry, unlike some people at this table, I am objective. Uh -oh. And that not enough. You got 10 bucks on that, Eric? I don't have 10 bucks after the check that I got in my pocket from you earlier tonight. I got no complaints about my check, boss. Wait a minute, here comes Steve Rhymes again. He was thrown out of here earlier. Again, this champion of ours can't do anything by himself. Jerry Lynn sent in to Brian Logan. Justice Payne, pain thriller, pain thriller. The referee's out, Eric. Here comes Nick Gage. Oh, oh no! This is not good! That this is not good! That animal has just been released from his cage! He's got a sight set on some raw meat right here. You love seeing this, don't you, Lobo? There it is! Bam! And it just broke our champ in half. Did you hear the crappy sound? What was that snapping sound? I think I just heard our champion be broken in half. Nick Gage, what an alliance. Is he aligned with Jerry Lynn? Who would have thought that Nick Gage would be independent tonight? I had no idea, boss. Justice Payne now going on instinct. Jerry Lynn moved to the midsection. Has him set up. Cradle pile driver. Cradle pile driver. Is that it? The Lowe Show is back now. Wait a minute, do we have a new world champion? I didn't hear anything about belts mentioned earlier tonight. 